Keeping venomous reptiles is an unforgiving hobby, requiring proper training and lots of experience. One simple mistake can be the difference between life and death. death, death. Remember, the most venomous snake in the world oh, is the whoa. one that just bit you. There are no venomous snakes with training wheels. Just because you see Viper Keeper handle snakes a certain way does not mean you should try it too. Alright, I put a HUD in, freshen their water dish, turn the heat up a little bit more. Now I'll put them back, play without any major conflagrations. You guys are just so pretty. Come on. I know you've had enough of me t uh, pulling your tail. You're a boy, huh? You're a boy. There you go. Come on in there. Come on. Of course, they, they won't go through the uh, through the doorway. They'll just uh, go around. Okay, now for the storm's eye. Now these guys... <laughs> will stand their ground and not, uh, and not give any way. Go in the hut. Go ahead. There. It's nice and dark. Go in the hut. There you go. There you go. I'm watching you. Yeah. Go in the hut. This is the one that tried to, try to hang off my nose. Quite just, the attitude. Just like every uh, female snake I, I have to mess with, uh, definitely has a serious uh, attitude problem. And she's about the right size to be a real, real first class anus, right? <laughs> uh, but isn't she beautiful and, and quite adorable? Got your tail. I know you're looking out at me. Here, just don't bite your uh, your roomie there. Yeah, leave it alone. Oh. All right. Well, if you want to go in there, that's fine. Hey. Dueling cobras. Oh, oh, you're pissy, I'm pissy, we're all pissy. Now where's the other one? He's burrowing. Ah. The male I'm has... I'm sure he's not burrowing around the corner to surprise you. Yeah, the... Here he is. Here's his little head. I thought that's what he was Boink. doing. He was coming around to surprise you. You play whack-a-mole. Hi, dude. Let's see. You got some, some substrate to play in now. Let's let them explore their cage, and unfortunately tomorrow morning they will get uh, you know, probably some baby food and Pedialyte, um, maybe a little flagell. Now don't bite anybody else. It's hard to pick out her eyes. But they apparently work pretty well. That's now she's glaring at me. I'm behind you, so if she charges, don't crush me. Okay. Well, you know, Storm's the Eye was supposed to have been the phallus of the bunch of the uh, three species or known species of water cobra. And certainly, uh, you know, I'm not even certain she's Storm's the Eye, but uh, she's, she's a, 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 she might be a patternless, Ooh. These guys really have attitude. Yes, I know. You, you want to figure out what I am and how to bite me and kill me, huh? huh? I know. I know. I need a bigger hook. <laughs> I need a bigger hook. See, I mean, uh, hang on. You know, I don't know if 
<laughs> here. Is that I want to escape or? Uh, I'm challenging you. Yeah. Look at that. Hey, look oh, at look the at the tail, tail going. Hi. See, now it. In my younger days, I would be tapping her on the head and pushing it down to challenge her. But, you know, uh, I don't feel like getting bit and going to the hospital. So, I'm not going to even attempt the fates. Uh, because normally, you know, if, if, the, if a snake challenges you like this, uh, you know, you, there are things you can do to uh, put you in a more dominant position. But, you know, I'm not really into that. I, I, I just want you to, to relax and do well. And, uh, yeah, you see that hand over there, don't you? Huh? I just want you to uh, start feeding. I don't want to stress you out. Uh, I just want you to do well and, uh, and flourish. Your eyes are pretty stealthy, huh? Yeah, it's hard to see those eyes. It's hard to see those eyes. Yeah, I know. I know. If I remember correctly, I mean, this probably is not Storm's eye. It's just a patternless one of uh, whatever we're looking at. I think Storm's eye has a solid band uh, on the belly, but you know, I don't want her to think too much because she could sort of charge right up the hook and I'd have to drop the whole thing before she got there and that would be ugly. Huh? That would be ugly. I know. I know. Okay, come on. Go back in here. You've done your job for the night. You've you, asserted your dominance. You frightened Viper Keeper away. Oh, what? Not done yet. <laughs> Come on, get back in there. I get out my hot oh. <laughs> dihydrogen oxide spray. She's laughing at your, your water spray. She's a water cobra. Oh, I'm immune to that, Viper <laughs> Keeper, you, you doofus. <laughs> Ah, but I have my my silicon shield here. Hi. Are you upset because I wet you down, huh? You should drink. It would be very healthy for you, huh? Whoa! <laughs> no visiting. No, no snake hockey on the floor. Oh, come on. Get back in there. Huh? Yeah. Do like the other ones. Just crawl about the cage. You know, why can't they put things on cage... Ah! Almost got your head a little <laughs> toad. Um, why can't they put things that hooks will stay in so you can safely move the glass without having something hanging off your fingertips. Uh, that is, you know, a lot of times you'll hear a crash and a noise and it's just the hook skipping over it. Yeah. And the yeah. fact that this is, this Midwest uh, hook, this is their titanium hook, is so light and it's so flexible, um, you know, it's not going to break or anything, but, you know, it gives way when you put pressure on it so it doesn't grab those things uh, too terribly well. But <laughs> and one of them is in here looking out. Um, I'm going to have to go get some shiners and see if they like that. I don't know what to quite do with them, but uh, they're going to eat tomorrow one way or the other. Yeah, I know they're a big ass, badass girl, huh? Uh huh. Calm down. All right, now uh, back to our regularly scheduled uh, cleaning program. For a bunch of non-feeders, uh, you're certainly attracting enough flies. I'm 
the other one is uh, one is okay, and you will not do anything with. Come on. And the other one. Wow, look at him, or her. Definitely a cobra. Absolutely. Well, we're going to, uh, we're going to, need to entice them to, uh, feed by force feeding them. Um, let me move this out of the way. If you can give that a swish in the Clorox and bring it back. I'm not sure of its status. Man, are you gorgeous. But you are foul like you can't imagine. Eh, I know. Just wait. If you're upset now, give me five minutes and I'll give you a good reason to be upset. <laughs> uh, uh, we're going to do this already, huh? Uh, uh. This is why you don't ever take your eye off the cobra. Mm -mm. Like some people I've seen on YouTube, they, they stop looking at the cobra, next thing they know they're hang, it's hanging off them. I mean, it's tough enough not to get bit by these guys when pinning them, uh, just because they're strong and very tricky and their skin and their scales are just absolutely glass smooth. Uh, it's tough to get a good grip. Round and round we go. Hi. Hi. Well, we're going to do some constricting tonight, huh? Okay. Normally, we don't take snakes out and play with them and mug for the camera here. The reason why this gal is out is because we need to get some food into the gullet before we start losing uh, a weight. And although that's that's a bigger one than I had hoped. Let me pull a couple of these out with you. When you want fat ones, you can't find them. When you want skinny ones, you don't get them. Hmm? Gonna let them, well, these are not terribly warm. So we're just gonna go ahead and start uh, uh, the battle. Are uh, you ready to bite that? Are you ready to bite that? Oh, that's good, huh? Good chomping there. Now, as Mrs. Viper Keeper will tell you, it's very difficult shedding water cobras without getting bit. Uh, feeding them, I don't know yet. Because the last time I force fed these, I cannulated them Cannulation is very good. It gets them hydrated. It gets food into them with relatively little fuss and muss. However, if you want to get them used to whatever you're trying to get them to eat, cannulation is not the way to go. You little stinker. You are strong. You are strong and you're trying to get that fang around and into my finger. Eh? Now normally I would force feed four or five in an established animal. Look at that death roll coming.
but I just want to get one or two down the gullet because if you overfeed them the stress and overfeeding them you will uh, likely have them regurge which is something uh, we don't want them to do now the, those those are dirty because they were in a wild caught snake's gullet so I'm not going to cross contaminate all these note to self it is important to keep the the hand dry that's holding the snake mm. <laughs> because a little bit of water on their skin and there's no way you can hold them I know Hopefully this goes a little bit easier than this first one. Oh boy, you are a toughie. These are a big oversized. That's a nice knot you've tied yourself into. Well, it's better it ties itself than me. It was trying to grab hold of my arm, which if it got away, I was screwed. Oh, folks, I've got a terrible cramp in that hand. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Look at the knot. <laughs> it's just fighting every way it can. And the most effective way it can fight is to sink a fang into my finger, which will immediately make me stop what I'm doing. Wow. He says, I've had enough, I'm tying myself in knots. Oh, I need, you can do. I need some assistance here because it's, never mind. Got him? Stay clear. See, I was very good at untangling knots in my fishing line. <laughs> uh, Let's okay. not let him do any more. Now, don't poop on me. They always I'll, poop on me. I'll take the poopy end. You can have the pointy end, okay? You want to do that? I'll trade you. <laughs> Sorry, I was doing heart massage. <laughs> I didn't realize it. God. Okay, well, that's all. That one's going to go. Um, I know, I know. If I... Billy, you're gonna bite me. There you go. Okay. You who are in shed will be left alone right now. However, we <laughs> try to not around the other guy. Get back there. Oh, that guy's angry. <laughs> yeah, you're not going to be happy either. This one just shed for the second time. Uh, that needs to be switched. No use cross-contaminating them. Hi. I know I got you by the tail. Oh, well, I'm force-feeding you. Mrs. Viper Keeper can pull the shed off your tail. Oh, God. Seriously? Yeah. No, 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 no. You got my fingers wrapped up in your little knot there. So... We need a much bigger table. Well, yeah, but we don't have the room for a much bigger table. Now, since these are, this is a bigger snake, causing bigger problems. You people think this is easy. I love it when people say, oh, Viper Keeper, you make this look easy. <laughs> it's not that easy, folks. I'm glad uh, I sort of make it look easy, but it's really, really not. Look at you, you 
especially these water culverts are just bad news. Ha! You thought you were going to get a finger. Ha! Oh, look at that dummy. He stuck, my, stuck his finger in my mouth. I'm going to buy it. Ah, nah. <laughs> it's all right. Come on. Sorry folks, if the camera is not really smooth, I'm trying to pay attention to what's happening in addition to filming. I'm trying to keep the animal, the other end, from nodding and keep it straight so ouch. he can uh, do what he needs to do. I said ouch because that thumb muscle that abducts the thumb towards your palm is cramping. Oh, well thank you. You know, unfortunately, God, you just are going to knot around me any way you can. The rougher and more difficult the time they give me, the more rough that I have to be. Stay there. We're gonna hook you there. And we're gonna release you. There you go. Is the other guy still be, in there? <laughs> you can be really pissed off with the other one. And the boy is like, I'm in shed, leave me alone. Make sure the other one's still in there because we have that door open. I don't I hope it didn't slip out the yep. side of the cage. It's in there. That would be just like it. Okay. Oh, I only got a little bit of poop on me. 